what would happen if the Millennium Falcon crashed into the Earth. To discover the amount of destruction a light speed spaceship would do upon hitting the Earth, we need to find the force. To do that I need to know the mass and acceleration. I won't do much math in this video, I'll just get to the point. I'll start with the acceleration. A universal fact is that nothing with mass can travel the speed of light. Typically, people will put it at 99% the speed of light in this case. Whereas the speed of light is 299,792,458 meters per second, the universally possible version of 99% is 296,794,533 meters per second. We usually see that the ship takes 2 seconds to reach light speed, so the acceleration is 148,397,267 meters per second per second. All to do now is find out how heavy it is. Oh wow, this'll be hard. Looking at the ship, it has a confirmed length of 114 feet. However, the guns and other parts look as if they could easily compact into other areas, making it actually easy to find the mass. It'll end up being a cylindrical shape, so using the cylinder volume formula I found the volume. It, like most other spaceships, are made of titanium. Titanium's density multiplied by the ship's volume gives us its mass. The Millennium Falcon is 3,737,635 kilograms. Finally, multiplying the mass by the acceleration gives us our long-awaited answer. The ship would slam into Earth with 555 trillion newtons, or in other words, 123 trillion pounds of force. Sure it sounds like a huge number, but what is it really? Well, if I change course and calculate the energy produced by the ship, I can find out how big the explosion would be. It produces 165 sextillion joules of energy, that is almost 4 million megatons of TNT. That kind of explosion is bigger than anything the Earth's ever seen. Its explosion area is 22% of the Earth's area. That's as big as all of the continents smashed together except Asia. In short, this explosion would wipe out lots of civilization. Until next time, I'm the Theorizer.